How's it going, everybody? I'm Danny D. This is Seven Daily Bananas, and we are about to watch. Yes. Welcome, folks. Thank you very much for joining me. I appreciate it. This season has been summed up to be an amazing season for me. I am really appreciating all of the episodes that I'm seeing right now. It's taken us, taken me through not an extreme roller coaster, but a familiar one, which has its own extremes. If you if you've never been through this kind of life, or if you've never gone through any of these types of situations. I can understand how it might look pretty despairable. <laughs> Let's go ahead and get this started. This is gonna, these last two episodes I feel are gonna, gonna reveal some really cool shit and probably some really bad shit as well. <laughs> That's just shameless, folks. So I'm not gonna get my hopes up too much, you know, but right, here we go. Beagle, beagle, beagle. You again? Yeah, really? me again. Yes. What? What could you possibly have been doing more important than watching the show last week? I wasn't doing Here's anything. I meant. was watching the show last week. Come on, Toto. Stop following me. No! <laughs> Sorry, I didn't want to bother you. What is it? What's going on? I let my dad out. God damn, dude, it just feels like his world. Everyone around him is just crumbling, dude. All the people that he cares about is just crumbling. This is the stuff that he's doing good so far. I don't know how else to put it, honestly. It's a cute weaving of arms and hands and stuff. The trauma doc stabilized your toes, but there's a good chance you're gonna lose them. It's critical that you see a surgeon today. You're gonna lose? Wait, did I hear, wait, what? Wait, what? You're gonna lose them? She's gonna lose toes? Fuck. That night he found a towel on the bathroom floor and started slapping her around. Mom was screaming. He told her to shut up, but she didn't. Fuck me, dude. Fuck. Can you go to my apartment with me later to pick up a few things? Yeah, of course. Dude, she got me with the breathing right there. That, uh, she did that really well. That was. I let you stay in my apartment and you sue me? Why am I the bad guy? Hey, Rusty, have you guys been feeding him? Is there water in his bowl? I will kill you with my bare fucking hands. Why aren't you getting, I was gonna say, do you just not have a fucking key? Yeah, they changed the locks, motherfucker. Locks changed? This is my apartment, hello? Did you change the locks on my apartment? God, I don't even know how you would handle that. No idea. Wherever they are. You're saying we should preach in gay nightclubs. Why not? Hmm? Nightclubs, street corners. Excuse me. Two big dudes just showed up. They're trying to take one of the kids. Oh shit. Stop. Wonderful. Now he's just gonna be Messiah again, isn't he? Everyone I'm still not sold on the whole cult thing. I'm really not. Like, I don't think this is just a bunch of people that need help. Like, but it is one of the twists. <laughs> so you think you can get your roof fixed for $500 from a guy that's got insurance? You don't have insurance? Hey, I do honest work, and I pay my men exactly what I say I'm gonna pay them. It's always some asshole gaming the system saying, oh, I'm hurt. Anybody think of Frank? <laughs> right when he said that? Because I know I did. <laughs> we are having a little party upstairs. Great, I'm Kevin. We, we just need the chocolate one. A thousand for the hour. The chocolate. Oh, shit. That's my wife. 1500 2000 if it runs over. Oh, dude, Look, you're pal, about to my get wife punched. Isn't 2000 No, oh, maybe not. I guess not. 3000 Oh, my God! I mean, look, she's worth it, but you should really meet the other one. Crazy in bed, and she knows accounting. Four grand for the black one, final offer. Holy fuck, are you serious, Kevin? Are you serious, dude? I mean, yeah, it's a lot of money. Don't get me wrong. He thinks I'm a whore? Of course. No, it's just a misunderstanding. Okay, good. I was like, I hope that didn't get her thinking. $4,000? Oh, no, no. Now she's thinking, fuck. Don't. I'm sorry, but don't. Damn, that's a lot of money. It is. It is a lot of money, but don't do it. I'm the director of hotel security. Oh, shit. Hmm. $4,000. <laughs> Thank God. 
Thank God, Jesus. I knew she'd think, I knew, yeah, raise an eyebrow for anybody, I think. The trauma doc was inclined to amputate, which may have been warranted. All three toes are severely damaged, crushed, for lack of a better word. Next thing you know, you lose your leg. But you can fix them, right? Surgery is only part of the process. You'll be off your feet for months, and then at least a year of physical therapy. A year? I can't. Well, what would the surgery cost? It'll run you at least $50,000. Mm, fuck. Well, what happens if I can't afford the surgery? I just die? No. We remove the toes, and then you're back on your feet in a couple of days. The small three toes, I would imagine you could get used to that pretty easy. I mean, you do use them for balance, but you use your big toe mostly. I use my big toe and my pointer toe mostly for balance. I used to work this corner. Where's g Dog? That's his brains, right there. Oh, the shit. Dark spot. Oh, no. Shoot her down! Shoot down! Why would they be shooting for Carl? Oh, my God! They shot at us! This is epic! What in the fuck is wrong with this girl? Oh, my God! You need to run away, Carl. Run. Hey, Google something for me, will you? Sure. Google, do you need your toes? Please. You, we, are harboring a runaway 14-year-old. Legally, you have no standing as his protector or guardian. Then who will protect him? Are you saying we shouldn't be helping people just because it could be dangerous? Because if so, what the hell are we doing here? We're not bigots. We love our son. We don't think Blake needs to be heterosexual to be a good person. We believe he may be mentally ill. Trigger. Trigger for Ian, specifically. Your contractor had no insurance. You only have a half a million in liability. Is that? Oh, what is she from? She looks totally familiar. What is she from? The jury's gonna take one look at that man and his starving family and the slumlord bitch that ruined their lives by hiring an unlicensed contractor and you're gonna be lucky if they don't put you in jail. Fuck that, dude. He was, oh God, see, this is where the system's fucking fucked up. The guy was obviously working under the table as well. Like, what the fuck? Like, it's not like he signed a W-2 anywhere. He knew what he was getting into. Like, ah, oh, God, I hate this shit. Six million dollars? Fuck, can you justify trying to sue for six million dollars? Jesus fucking Christ. He likes his little penis robbed and on it. He's gonna, she's gonna steal her man. Is that what's gonna happen? I had imagined you humbled like this so many times. I was worried it would be anticlimactic. It's not. <laughs> you were born a whore. You will die a whore. She's asking for a punch in the face. Excuse me. Oh, you were just in reach, too. Hi. Now she's gone. <laughs> the moment is gone. Uh, oh, and Hello, look at sweetie. what he had. Oh, 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 my God. Today, I'm headed for the club to the low. He dikes in the enemy. He's got his time for a the chimney. What is he singing? Yeah. It's not so bad now, is it? I knew it too. You, you can see that it was kind of running that direction. Like there's no fucking way it just kind of happened that way. They put me into therapy three days a week. They put me on these drugs, knocked me on my ass. I couldn't even get out of bed. That's what they really want. So that I can't have sex with another boy, you know? Fuck. Ever. What is like the chemical castration shit? Uh, Ian's really putting himself in a not a good not a good place, honestly. Drop the suit and you can live here rent free for a year. I'll even pay your hospital expenses. You're just making it worse. Break the window. Yeah. Rusty? Hey! What the fuck? fuck? All of you give me my goddamn dog! I'd break the window. Fuck you. If my dog was in there, fuck you. You couldn't keep me out of that apartment. No fucking way. Especially if I heard that, I would have been in there. In a heartbeat. Now, I mean, are you a little bitch woman beat? Yeah, yeah, fuck, fuck, fuck. Who the hell is recording? Okay. He's a big dude, Lip. Maybe it's just a halfway house. That was planned. He's trying to put him back in jail. Oh, run away, run away, dog. Yeah. Get her. <laughs> <laughs> but she, that's gonna fuck with her too, guaranteed. They're gonna find a way to fuck with her on that. Oh, Jesus. See, it feels like we're back to old shameless shenanigans now. It's, it's just like, now it's just chaos and absolute anxiety. <laughs> 
dude, you gotta get rid of the, you gotta cut that off, fuck. Start with the little one, cut the joint. Once You're getting Liam to do this? Are, Are you, you nuts? nuts? If I pass out, keep going. Do not forget to call 911. Oh, fuck! Are you kidding me right now? Although I see, I see the point, I probably, dude, honestly, I probably would have done the same fucking thing back in the day. Like, why would I ask a doctor to cut these off? I could cut them off just fine myself. <laughs> hey, he passed out. <laughs> and more than likely, I would do that too. I'd probably pass out before it happens. Oh, are you going to do? Oh, I was gonna say. I was gonna say. Is he gonna put the pieces together and just do it? Really? Oh. Jesus! If you like this highlight and you want to see more of me watching this completely unedited, hit that link below, Seven Deadly Bananas on Patreon. Get in there and start watching TV with me. Ah, fuck! Fuck! I mean, good job, but fuck! What you waiting for? He just walks in totally non gad just fucking way casual right now. What are you doing? And he's gonna cauterize the wound. Although that th that looks like it should already, the gangrene already looks like it's good. Like it's down, it's in there. That's hardcore. That's hardcore of that. He just walks right in and does it. No questions, no asking, doesn't even try to wake her up. Oh, they must be cutting off her toes. <laughs> Could you please just stitch him up for me? I got welding school next week. I guess they're okay. The gangrene totally looks like it's fucking... My God is trans, a junkie, a whore! <laughs> Will not be victims. I know everybody's supposed to look badass during an explosion, but I'm glad he flinched. <laughs> what in the world? Jesus. What do you got in there, a dead body? I do not believe she's dead yet. What? Oh, she's gonna take her place. I fucking knew it was gonna be something like that, but not that way. I thought it was just gonna be like, just steal her man. Oh my God, are you kidding me? She's fucking, oh my God. Oh God, uh -huh. you seriously don't remember what happened last week on Shameless? I remember. Roll the tape. Yeah, you ain't scared nobody with no bat. Not me anyway. Liam is asleep out in the backyard. Is that normal? <laughs> no. <laughs> oh my God. Is he still just, oh, he's just freaking out from the toes? I think you were sleepwalking again. Really? Yeah. Are yeah, those my keys? Uh, hmm. I don't know. <laughs> her mother is coming to the wedding. Whoa, whoa, whoa. She's gonna know Svetlana isn't her daughter, right? Scary old Soviet. Survived Stalingrad as a young girl by eating human flesh. Oh, she was a cannibal? Fuck. <laughs> and she's like, yeah, bitch. <laughs> He's not here. I don't think he came home last night. Oh, had the police been here yet? They have a warrant for his arrest. Oh, shit. I mean, makes sense, dude. You can't do something like that without something. How are you today? Fan-fucking-tastic. Pink yeah? cloud. I got laid last night. Oh. Cammy? Oh. Yeah. Uh, Asshole. <laughs> <laughs> that was rad. Zlata? What if she's hungry? Super. I mean, what do cannibals eat other than people? <laughs> what kind of sight is that? <laughs> oh, <laughs> super long last name. <laughs> but they are prepared to settle. Really? For three million. What the fuck? Sign the title of the building over to them. You gotta be fucking kidding me. <sighs> and they want sparkles. They want sparkles back. Shut the fuck up. Before it goes to trial. And spend the money. Go and to spend Vegas, the money. Take a trip around the world. And then just declare bankruptcy. Bankruptcy? What? 
It's better than letting them take everything you own. What the fuck? What the fuck? What kind of shit is that? Oh. I'd like you to consider Super red hair. letting me share custody of Franny. I can afford to pay child support, and I know you could use the money. Go fuck yourself, Derek. Oh, yeah, that must feel a little good, but still. She chugs it down, Jesus Lord. Oh, oh you just killed her. You just killed her. <laughs> Dude, there was so many pills. It's such a little amount of vodka. 40. Jesus, I called to see if you'd be interested in buying my building, not to get bent over a fence. Well, it's a distress sale. 30. Oh, fuck off, lady. You know what? Go fuck yourself. Good girl. Trying to teach her a lesson? You have to eat. <sighs> Trevor's here. He wants to talk. Well, they're threatening to send cops to the center to round up kids, throw them into group homes, send them back to their parents. They want you to give Blake back to his parents and for you and Vic to turn yourselves in. I'm making a difference here. Oh no, he's gonna ask the question, isn't he? I'm worried about you. Think that you might be off your meds. They raid the center tomorrow. It'll be all over the news. My donors will disappear. The city will probably yank my permits and I'll have to shut down. This is about you loving all of the attention and the hero worship. If you care about these kids, I mean truly care about them, You'll turn yourself in before anyone gets hurt. Truth bombs, Ian. Very much. Truth bombs. Will he listen? I feel like he will. Ian's a good dude. He's probably, hmm, I don't know. <sighs> we'll have to get an extra bedroom, too, for the kids. Uh, I want six. I want six. And three boys and three girls. And their names will uh, start with a C and a K, just like us. Like God, this is so many levels of wrong. And we can uh, eat fast food and get really fat. And be like real people, Carl. Oh my god, that all sounds incredibly awful. <laughs> yeah, Carl, dude. <laughs> hey, okay. Is that just one hand free? Nope, nope, okay, okay. Is this a dream? Run your ass off, dude. Why are you even trying to sneak? There's no point. She will find you. Just go, man. Go early back to school or something. Good job. Good job. Up! Everyone up! Come on! I need sheets. I need lots and lots of sheets. Oh God, what the hell is that gonna do? Well, you need sheets for it, Ian. Well, I better go get the bride. Thank God there's a prenup, right? Oh, no. Does that mean, wait, does a prenup work in death? Huh, I don't know. Because a prenup is if they break up or divorce. I don't know if it happens to the death you part part. I don't know, I don't know much. Hmm. I'm gonna call the police who could have killed us. How many people are in there? Holy fuck. Here's the deal, shithead. This. $4,000. Every month for the next year, assuming you drop your bullshit lawsuit, I can send you a money order for $500. And who knows? In the end, you might lose. We won't lose. She had, honestly, the lady, if I had to, if I had to retract everything, she had, I, she was the one that gave away the idea. That's, I got a vibe off of her. That's why I was completely like, nope, nope, no good, don't do it. From the get go, she was the one that gave it away. That smile, I've seen it before, could tell right away and she does it perfectly. Anybody who's never been through something, they could, could oh my God, you could tell that she's the, she's the ringleader. Why would that make you cry? She's burning money right now. That's not hurting anybody but her, technically. Alrighty then. No, 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 no. Are no, you no. fucking kidding me? God damn it. We'll take the cash. Okay, okay. Sign this. Come on, turn around. Is that real money you just burned? Yeah, they just about 
fucking kill me. Yeah, right? I was gonna say 200 bucks, that's a lot. I wouldn't be able to do that. I wouldn't have done it that way at all. There's no way I would have burned money. <laughs> no fucking way. You do you died. fucking love me? I don't know. I want to. You know, I really do, but I I've been sleepwalking through my life for years, and I don't know how to be with myself, let alone someone else. And I don't know what I want, but... I know I have to be honest with you. And honest with himself. I'm sorry. That's gotta be, that's gotta be one of the hardest things he's been through, honestly. If it's at all comparable to real life. Saying what he said, he just admitted to himself that same thing just as much as he was talking to her, he was talking to himself about that. Like, that was real shit. That was real shit. Good job, Lip. Good job. The truth hurts, but at least now you can grow from it. Things can happen from here, you know? Now everybody knows where everybody stands. They could end up back together. They seem like a nice couple, but Lip, Lip is making the right choice for right now, just at this moment. Fuck, Ian, here we go. This is what I was worried about. What is happening? It's a cool slogan. <laughs> God is gay and he loves you. I love it. I'm Ian Gallagher. All right, arrest them all. <laughs> really? Shut up. Really, you're gonna arrest everybody? Excuse me. I don't know. I don't know if that was good or bad, frankly. I have no idea. No idea how to even remark on it. Come on, Kev. Are you gonna save her? The whole point is to be rich. A prenup? Uh. Uh. Beautiful dress. It's very Disneyland. You gonna get that? Nope. No. Siri declined the call. <laughs> Good job, dude. Good fucking job. I'm not gonna check inside the porta potty. Okay. I was gonna say. No. 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 Oh my god! Oh. Oh. Fuck! I can't! I can't right now! What the fuck? Oh! 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 That was so gross, dude. It's a shitty smurf. <laughs> Fucking shitty smurf. Thank God. Thank God. <laughs> Thank God. Holy shit. I hope he's all right. Right. Police have identified the man. Oh, God. The smell. The oh, smell. Oh, the smell is bad, and he's just squishing his shoes. Gross, sponge, fucking smurf shit all over the. Oh, bleh, bleh, bleh. oh, that was good. That was good. There was a lot of things that happened. Ian is not necessarily where I thought he would be. I don't think it's going to be in the twist. I think the people that are following him will be kind of the twist, maybe. Again, it's just a dangerous thin line. That's all it is. I don't think he's really crossed the line yet at all. You know, like he, I, I feel like he's voicing something that absolutely needs to be voiced and he's finding more and more reason to be as loud as possible. And he's doing it, I think, in a way that is not hurting people per se, but the people he are, he's helping are also very vulnerable. And if he doesn't measure up to the expectations of what they have, that ends up being a bad scenario. That ends up being a very bad scenario. If he decides that he is some kind of messiah, that's a big bag, 
really bad scenario. There's just so many variables of it fucking up and crumbling and exploding. It's just dangerous. I just don't know, again, I just don't know if Ian is wise enough to understand how to handle the power that he, is, he just has all of a sudden. Anyway, great episode. I'm so glad Carl escaped. Maybe, I, does that mean he's not gonna be in the next season? Is he gonna be gone again for a little while or whatever? I don't know, anyway. End of the season, holy fuck, we're already here. We only got one, two, three more seasons left, nine, 10, 11, holy shit, I can't believe we got here. It's been so long, hasn't it? But it also feels like it hasn't. <laughs> All right, you guys, thank you so much for watching with me. I absolutely appreciate all the support. And we will most definitely see you on the next season.